In this short video, I'm going to show you how to post as a user on a Facebook page that you are an admin for. So here's how you do it. You go up to the little button on the top right that says Edit Page. You click there. Then you go to the top left button, Your Settings, and you're going to click off the button that says always comment and post on your page as whatever that page is and in this case it's WAMTECH Dr. Phillips so I'm going to save changes then I'm going to go back and view page and then just to demonstrate I'm going to comment here on a post that I just did about uh, Laura Lee Shapiro one of the WAMTECH members where as the admin I was promoting something that a member is doing uh, promoting her business but now I'm going to post personally you see the difference there there's my little picture personal picture versus the admin post that I just did and I'm gonna say Laura Lee's uh, Laura Lee's baskets and if you saw that it tagged her automatically and brought her up let me just do that again so you'll see that I kinda went through that fast but part of what I'm trying to do here is to actually tag her Laura Lee Shapiro has beautiful delicious baskets delicious delish how do you spell delicious <laughs> delicious baskets and um, and I can't wait to order some for order one for my mother's my mother's upcoming birthday okay so that's what you do now part of why why would you do that well one of the reasons is as as I just demonstrated sometimes you want to post sort of officially as the page and then sometimes you want to come in personally and give it a recommendation it gives a little bit more of a personal touch than just having the corporate logo on a page another reason that I want to post personally is I want to tag Laura Lee now by tagging her it's going to show up in her notifications up here in these little red boxes so that when she's up here notifications and she's checking you know what's happened she's going to see that I mentioned her and uh, she's going to come back to that and um, and know that I mentioned her otherwise I could just post something on the page about her and she may not ever know that I posted this on her page about her so I want her to know and I want her to come over and have some more interaction another example that I saw a good reason to post personally uh, in this particular page uh, one of our members Donna received a birthday gift now our birthday card so I want to say personally and just add this touch glad you enjoyed it we love our we 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 love you just say something personally to her about a birthday card so that's one of the reasons that I would want to do that and here I see Dawn Peachy Dawn has written an article here and so I want to say Dawn Peachy again I'm gonna tag her Dawn Peachy is absolutely brilliant absolutely brilliant and can help you with your business very good now Dawn's gonna see that so if we were to time delay this we'd probably see in a few minutes or even a few hours that Dawn has come back over and uh, commented on that and possibly Laura Lee will do the same thing here so I hope that that's helpful to you and that you have learned how to post as a user instead of as an admin on your page now obviously if I want to switch back go back to edit page your settings switch back to always comment as save changes and then when I go back I have now I, I call it putting on the uniform I basically have slipped back into the uniform of the WAMTEC DP Divas and if I do a post here I'm just going to do a test post so that you'll see that I'm now posting as the Divas and I'm going to delete that because I don't want a test post on the page okay take care